Hey guys and welcome back to another Farmer Simulator 2019 Fact Sheet Friday. We have three today and one of which we've definitely not seen before and it's right here in front of us. New Holland Skid Steer. It's the New Holland L218 with the Paladin High Dump Bucket. So it is a skid steer loader, costs 125k, 61 horsepower, 74 litres of fuel, and does 11 miles an hour. Uh, the bucket, obviously skid steer bucket, costs 4 grand and basically can hold everything and anything and even more. So let's take a closer look at this and... We did definitely not know about this one. It's interesting to see... New Holland come into the game with skid steers. It's pretty cool. I'm surprised. I've seen a few people saying about why not John Deere? Why not Bobcat? Um, Bobcat, I am surprised I've not approached. Bobcat do have quite a few interesting machines. But the model on it does look good. I, I can't help but feel they're different tyres. I know they are... They look identical, basically. But the subtle changes in them, maybe it's just the lighting and how crisp and clean they look, is making me say this. But they definitely look different. And the bucket, uh, it's got teeth by the looks of it, or... Uh, oh no, that would be the auger from the manure spreader, so here is a manure texture. And uh, anyone recognise this? Definitely reuse that. But really not much to show on the bucket. It's a bucket. It does bucket things. Next factory. So, we have a brand new manure spreader coming into the game. You've seen this made as a mod a few times, it's it's an interesting one. And the Vultra T-Series. So, we'll start off at the front end, we've got the Vultra T-Series, obviously it's a tractor, it costs 175,000 at base price, 110 horsepower to 150 horsepower, 380 litres of fuel, does 31 miles an hour, and... I guess it's a special feature, if you like, is uh, reverse drive control. And the setup you can do with it is engine, wheels, wheel brand, front loader, attacher, main color, rim color. And the tire options are obviously standard, wheel weights, wide tires, wide tires plus wheel weights, narrow tires, rear twins, twin wheels, and commercial. And onto the Coon, the SLC141. It is a manure spreader, costs 54,800, needs 180 horsepower to power it, working speed of 12 miles an hour, and the working width is 32 feet 10 meters, and holds 15,400 liters. And obviously, manure. And you can change the wheel setup and wheel brand. Interesting wheel brand. Whatever wheel brand can you put on the Smitchellins, maybe? And you can go standard and wide tyres. Definitely seen this as a mod a few times. Uh, side slinger. Pretty cool. Nice to see some American equipment because I think this is mainly American. And the Crone Big M450. At long last, we have the smaller version of it, not just the 500. The stuff for Palmo has been missing for a while now out of farm sim. I think the last time we saw it was FS13, and it has been missed. Yes, we've had it as a mod, but base game, we've not had one. I know a lot of people are very, very happy about this, myself included. It's nice to see this stuff for Palmo in the game. Long time coming. So it's the Crone Big M 450 self-propelled mower, costs 380,000, 449 horsepower, why don't they make it 450? Hmm. Oh well. Holds 780,000 litres, 24, horse, uh, 24 horsepower, wow, 24 miles an hour, uh, cruising speed, work speed of 15 miles an hour, and is a 9.9 .9 metre, 32 feet working width. And special features, working modes. Widespread, which I believe you are seeing here. Swath drop left, swath drop right, swath drop center. You silage guys, rejoice. <laughs> yeah, you're going to have fun with this one for sure. And when I said about the 150 horsepower, at uh, 450, I mean chrome. I'm surprised it is 149. Uh, let's have a look at the detail on this. See the linkage there. It's almost like I know it wouldn't be able to, but 
It's almost like you can take the front end of that off and put a different type of attachment on there. Snowblower? Hmm? I doubt it, but... Very, very nice. I, I am so ecstatic to see this back in the game. I really am. Used to use the big M a lot back in the day. Drifted away from it because I didn't think the mod was that great, but... There we go. Very short sweet fact sheets for this week only the three so just to recap we've got the big m here by chrome we have the muck spreader by coon and the vulture t series which we've known about so really we've got two new people well, three new pieces of equipment that we didn't know about we didn't know about this coon muck spreader we didn't know about the skid steer here and we most definitely did not know about this bucket although it's a bucket so Probably not many people care about that, but you never know what range of attachments these guys are going to bring it to the table. I'm kind of shocked about this though. Like this, you know, when I get these fact sheets at times, I was like, "Yep, no about that, no about that." Oh, and that this was one of them for sure. So that's your fact sheets, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed, and we will be back with more news when we get bought more news. Till next time, later.